Good morning, it's Nick from Allied Electrical. Um, welcome to a very snowy um, Oak Tree Avenue in Pucklechurch. Um, hope you're all staying nice and warm. Uh, got my scarf on, got my cup of tea. Um, just a quick video tip. Um, this is the second time this has happened in two weeks. The first time was on a job in Homefield Road um, last week. So I just thought I'd quickly throw a, a quick video up on this. And it's about these little bad boys, uh, rewirable fuses. So called to a property, um, fuse is gone because the lights have um, popped, the, popped the fuse on it. Now, with these ones, so the colour markings on the front, it tells you what size it is. In this case, it's a five amp because it's white. Now, the problem with that is if you can see in there, which real difficult to see, it's got a little bit of fuse wire in it. Now, this, it doesn't stop you. The colours on there obviously doesn't stop you putting any, any type of fuse wire you want in there, but it does then cause a bit of a problem. We've taken three of these out of this consumer unit this morning. The first one actually had a bit of 15 amp fuse wire in it. The second one had the correct bit of fuse wire in it, a little bit of five amp. And then the third one had this. Um, and again, this is what happened last week as well. So you can see this is um, this is actually five amp fuse wire, but somebody's, um, I don't know why they've done it, to be honest. Like maybe it was easier to thread or, you know, they just didn't know any different. But you can actually see, if I just count them, we've got one, two, three, four, five individual threads of five amp fuse wire. So that's now no longer five amp fuse wire, it's 25 amp fuse wire. So obviously now the weak link in the circuit is the wiring. So the wiring will actually uh, melt or burn through before the fuse blows. So the reason for this tip this morning is basically just double check if you do have any of these rewirable fuses. Um, and it's p particularly a problem with the, the five amps because they're normally the ones that blow when a light bulb goes. Um, just double check you are actually using 5 amp fuse wire in it and not uh, 15 or 30 amp fuse wire or twisting multiple strands together. Obviously the better bet is the modern sort of trip trip switch style uh, consume unit but that's not an option for everybody so um, yeah so thank you very much for watching um, stay warm stay safe and thanks for watching bye bye.